as a cutting. Hacker Dad needs a haircut. Sometimes you come up with that idea that changes you. All right, so I've been growing this for about three months. Having my hair pulled up in a ponytail for a year, it permanently changed my hairline and my hair is growing in ways I never thought was possible. All right, so I've been growing out my hair the entire year and today's the day. And this project really pushed engineering to its limits. All right, it's a fail today. Scissors just aren't sharp enough to cut hair. And I couldn't believe it, but the day finally came. Hacker Dad here, and as a parent, I am really busy, and it's really hard just juggling all the different things you got to do. Uh, we've got drop-offs, and I just haven't had time uh, to get a haircut. Come on, kids, let's go. So what we got today is a mobile hair cutting machine. And so this thing is perfect when you're on the go and you just need a haircut, and uh, you're doing just very drop -off, various drop-offs and stuff. So um, we're just gonna plug this thing in, and get it ready, and um, here we go. All right, everyone in? Yep. yep. All right, just make sure this thing's working before uh, we really get going. All right, let's go, kids. So yeah, as a parent, I just don't have time, and so um, just have to do things on the go. All right, kids, where do I have to drop you off at? The pool. The pool. All right. So looks like it's uh, almost there. So this is actually probably the third major version of this hair cutting machine. Um, the first one, I tried using something that was spinning, and um, spinning things do not work well with hair because things get really, really tangled. And so, uh, second version, I didn't have a sharp enough scissors, I uh, didn't have a sharp enough, uh, strong enough motor, so um, this is kind of like the third major version of uh, getting hair cutting scissors and um, a stronger motor. So we'll see how it goes. All right, here's a swing pool. All right, thanks, Dad. Thanks, kids. Bye, bye. So, drop-offs can be a lot, um, but someone's gotta do it. And so, I think the results are actually better than I expected. It did a very good job on the front, and in the back, it, it got that part too. Um, what I learned was the human head is not, it's not, a circle it's it's oval and so you got the scissors a lot closer here and in the back than on the sides and so uh, that's one reason why my sides are a little bit funny um, the other thing is with the scissor going around in this direction it cut this side of my head very different than this side and so um, you know very uneven cut but you know with all things said I think it was a success and I think it actually did a pretty good job so um, thanks for watching uh, this was a lot of fun and glad that I can actually use my project after over a year. So thanks for watching and keep hacking.